Creswell mother is living through a nightmare after her son was accused of making a hit list that named other students. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Templeman. And I'm Tanya Green. In for Renee McCullough. She's now speaking out, saying her son was bullied at Crestville Middle School. KEZI 9 News reporter Michael Severin shows us why she believes more needs to be done to stop harassment in school. Never thought my kid would be the one to want to plan something like this. The mother of a Cresswell Middle School student is in shock after deputies say her son wrote a hit list targeting other students. She didn't want her identity to be revealed and says her son could be expelled and face felony charges. She says he did it because he was being bullied. He just made a bad choice. And I think it's probably a good thing maybe he did get caught because it brought out him to say, I'm being bullied, harassed. The mother tells me she wants to apologize to the students who are on the list and their parents, and she is urging all parents to talk to their kids about bullying. She believes the school district needs to have a zero tolerance policy. If it was my kid on that list, I'd be mad too. I'd be full force going with the law, going to school, making sure this doesn't happen again. Cresswell Superintendent Todd Hamilton says he couldn't discuss any disciplinary actions or the reason behind the hit list, but says they take bullying seriously. Staff at the Crestwell School District are trained to recognize and prevent bullying. He encourages parents to talk with their kids and tell students to come forward to a trusted adult. Regardless of where a report comes from, if it comes to us, you know, we're going to look into the matter. The mother says her son has been released from custody and they don't have guns in their home. He's been suspended and an expulsion hearing is scheduled for next month. In Cresswell, I'm Michael Severin, KEZI 9 News.